and morning 8.45 the GPS worked. Otherwise, I had to pay a 10 lakh fine and I, used, I had to be behind the bars. This was what the bond I had to give to airport authority. If you're not going to take that first step, if you're not going to try, if you're not going to think, science is about trial. Science is constantly keep working your crazy ideas. Right, children? You're right? All experiments, people may call you crazy, but you love it, right? How many of you want to become a scientist? Wow! Wow, that's beautiful. The youngest scientist, give him a big round of applause. Because we are importing everything. So many things are being imported and we have so crazy about imported things. When are we going to start Make in India? We are talking about Make in India. Now we have to really make in India. And this satellite is a testimony that we've made everything right from the scratch in India. With all the jugads possible. We don't have a laboratory. My house kitchen was a laboratory. So we did the spin test with a fan, we did the uh, freeze test with a freezer, boiling test with boiling water. And it still flew the NASA Stereo Orion in 2017. That was our first suborbital mission and the world's lightest satellite, 64 grams, first ever made femto category satellite. NASA was blown away that... <laughs> That my children were all only 18 and uh, 17, 18 and 19 by then. And, uh, you know, they were shocked that, uh, you know, Indian children could do something like this. Uh, Chris Kohler was the director of uh, Colorado Space Grant Consortium, which was a knowledge partner for NASA, to select uh, the possible best proposals to be launched through NASA, Stereo Orion. So they saw our proposal and they went mad. Chris Kohler called me and said, Dr. Kaysen, I literally fell off the chair. What is it? Are you guys seriously making your 64 gram satellite? We said yes. Because people think with the term satellite, it's something so very complicated, complicated, complicated. But again, it is a bunch of electronics put together, encompassed in a beautiful uh, box structure, which has got good drawings that can connect to the uh, rocket. So he was like, we are going to support you. Come what may be. You have all our support and we will support you to build this uh, structure and you can test everything. So it was a tech demonstrative satellite uh, called the Kalam Sat. And when we built it and when we got chosen uh, uh, for NASA, we shared it in a press conference where there was conference but no press because people thought we were mad and it was not true. You won't believe they asked us our courier bill also. Are you going to send it by courier, madam, your satellite? Show us the courier bill. So that kind of, you know, show us this letter, show us that letter, everything, and they said, we just had only two people because there was a political meeting going on and my children were, ma'am, where is the press conference? Yeah, conference, we are all there, the conference. Press is not there, just two of them, it's okay, like, no problem. But on the reverse, on the contrast, when we launched the satellite, once when BBC put it up, and once NASA let out the information that Indian kids have done something like this, 900 media covered us across the globe. It is that first platform for children like them. If you're able to create that platform for them, I think our kids are super, super rockers. They can do fantastic. So we were greedy. We did the suborbital mission. Now we want to do an orbital mission. So again, we went back to ISRO. We said this time, you know, NASA gave us an opportunity. Can you all give us an opportunity? They were welcoming. They said, oh, really? Okay, come back, get the proposal. And we had, uh, you know, in Google, if you go and check, you have these Navagrahas in, uh, you are very scared of Navagrahas, right? Oh my God, what powerful. So those Navagrahas of ISRO were sitting in a conference room and they said, Chalo, give me a presentation. AC was in 19 and I was sweating like this, just like I'm standing in front of you all. It was so nervous, I was so nervous. But 
you know, they broke the wall of being snobbish or anything. They were so kind, so kind, the scientists at ISRO. They looked at every word possible. They made all the best possible corrections and everything. And first ever lightest student satellite, one U CubeSat Kalam V2 was built in six days. We built the satellite in six days and ISRO launched it on 24 January 2019. And the whole, that's where you watched Shivan, uh, Dr. Shivan talking about the satellite. So he was mentioning and they were so proud that our children could do something like this so different. So then moving on, we did the Satish Dhawan sat and this year for the 75th independent anniversary. Yes, please. Uh, that was 1.2 kilos. Thank you. Uh, actually, Amitabh Bachchan asked this question in his Karodpati. He said, which was the lightest satellite built by students of Chennai and how much would it weigh? So good question. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, from there on, for Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav, did you all see that uh, flag going up? Did you all see? What was it? Indian flag? You, you were happy to see that? So for the Indian uh, independence, 75th Indian independence, uh, we unfurled the national flag at 30 kilometers up near space. So this was considered to be the first uh, topmost celebrated celebration of India. <laughs> and beyond that, I thought we need to give a special, special a salute to all our warriors and to all the people who have sacrificed their lives. What best it could be other than bringing government school children together, build a satellite and launch it into space. So, who's the first person who went to moon? Raise hands, come here fast. Who's gonna come fast? I want somebody to come fast. Ah, come up, come up, hold me, hold me, hold me, hold me. <laughs> oh, see? Good. Congratulations. So you also came along with her, so congrats. Thank you. Next question for you all. Okay? Take your seat. Now come, both of you. <laughs> so who was the first person to go on the moon? Neil Armstrong. Very good. Come on, clap hands for these children. Bright young minds of India. Okay. Who went along with him but did not step on the moon? I don't know. Anybody knows that one? Come. You know the answer? Mm. Somebody went along with him. He's a captain. Okay, fine. But what is his name? Okay. What's your name? Bhavya. Bhavya. Hamilti. Very good. Sit down. You're all attentive. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Good. It is Buzz Aldrin who went with him, but he did not step onto the moon. Okay? Okay, next question. One more question. Don't get into your seats. Be ready, be ready. Can I ask you? Ah, okay. Who's the only Indian cosmonaut who went up into space? Until this day, there is only one hero. There is only one hero. Come fast, come fast, come fast! Yeah, no answering from there. <laughs> ah, good. <laughs> so you got the chocolate, right? Yes. What's your name? Pranav Narayan. Pranav Narayan. Big round of applause, parents. Come on. Very good. Space is one industry which is considered to be niche. Niche, Sabrina, people, you know, they don't look into it. It's like, it is always brushed away. The other, you ask about Ratan Tata, you ask about Ambani, everybody knows on earth. Anybody knows who's the ISRO chairman? Shh, come here. ISRO chairman? See? No, right? Okay, don't Google, huh? I'll tell you. Okay. He is Dr. Somnath. 
Dr. Somnath. And uh, if you see the uh, OneWeb 36 satellite launches that was done recently, it's considered to be very historic. And the brain and the man behind is Dr. Somnath. He's got an efficient team. He's a rocket scientist. And go and Google about him, children. Now go back home and Google, okay? Space is not scary. Space Kids India wants to bring space as economical and as affordable to all the children and not push it away so that, you know, nobody knows about space because space is the future. There's so much that we are getting to learn. Okay, how do you use your uh, mobile phones? Because of? So you should know about it, right? Your Sony TV, Z TV, Raj TV, Jaya TV. Satellites, right? We call it satellite channels, but we don't know those satellites. Right? Now you children should. You are the future. So go back home, Google about it. We have lots of doctors and engineers in the country. I think enough of doctors and engineers. We need more scientists and we need more scientists in the space industry. The space industry is opening up. There is so much of privatization and the policy is also out. You are getting startup funds for it. Little children are getting startup funds. If you have a unique idea, wacky idea, please come. Okay? Moving on, then what we thought, we will do the Azadi Sat. Something to remember about independent India. So we brought...